Ma, he's making eyes at me. Ma, he's awful nice to me. Ma, he's almost breaking my heart. Where are we going? Well, you said you wanted to go slumming, so I picked a place to eat in the village. Only wild poets and anarchists eat there. It's pretty tough. And go dashing up and down the hall. Da la 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 enjoyed himself so much in a long time. Then during lunch, Ralph showed him some pornographic pictures. Jimmy knew he shouldn't be interested, but well, he was curious. What Jimmy didn't know was that Ralph was sick, a sickness that was not visible like smallpox, but no less dangerous and contagious, a sickness of the mind. You see, Ralph was a homosexual, a person who demands an intimate relationship with members of their own sex. But by now, Jimmy felt a fondness for Ralph, and they continued to go places together. Ralph was generous and took Jimmy many interesting places and did many nice things for him. He bought presents and even gave him money, but payments were expected in return. You see, Jimmy hadn't recognized Ralph's approach soon enough. When Ralph first asked Jimmy to go fishing alone, he should have discussed it with his parents or teacher. Finally, Jimmy told his parents, and they reported it to the juvenile authorities. Ralph was arrested, and Jimmy was released on probation in the custody of his parents. But all homosexuals are not passive. Some resort to violence, as in the case of Mike Merrick.
there's a prize when 